Connecticut, what's going on? We are down here in New Haven in the living room slash recording studio of an awesome band by the name of Ponybird. Sitting to my immediate left is Jen D, founder, front woman, songwriter for Ponybird. How are you? Good. How are you? Good. So the term beautiful is often bandied about by journalists when they can't think of a different word, but I would describe this music as beautiful. Where, where is this wellspring that you draw inspiration from? I actually don't know when I write. <laughs> it just happens. And that question's come up before I've asked myself the same thing. It's always like uh, carrying the groceries or doing something where I don't have a pen or paper nearby and I'll hear something in my mind and think, oh, I gotta get to the guitar. I have to get to the MacBook. I have to get to the pen and paper and write it down. It just starts to come in kind of like a radio station. If you were to tune in and catch something you liked and think to yourself, oh, what's the name of that song? Oh, wait, I'm writing it. Oh, okay. And then get into the creative process. And we mentioned at the start of this interview that this isn't just a couch, but this is where you recorded the first two records. Yeah. So tell us how that process all came together recording in your living room. Okay. Um, a friend of mine who was on the show last week, MT Barrington, Matt Thomas, was really generous with helping me figure out how to use GarageBand. And once I figured out that I could lock myself in isolation, even though it's not a cabin in Wisconsin, I would put myself in here for hours at a time. And the first record that you hear, um, Climb Yourself Up, is actually me learning the process of recording. And each song is recorded sequentially as I'm mastering the program, which is something I haven't really told many people, but you could actually tell as it goes, I get a little bit better with each song at editing and layering. And the best part about it is when you're by yourself, you could put those headphones on and really go into the zone. And I have a habit of layering my vocals, which is something I haven't um, gotten to do live yet, but I do do it on the record. You'll hear a lot of harmony layering. And that's myself with myself, just picking harmonies and, and then expanding it ad nauseum because I have all this time on my hands in my living room and nobody's looking at the clock telling me, you know, that's going to cost you. So for those of you who haven't heard the music of Ponybird, go do that right now hit pause on your DVR because hearing the music and then realizing in the setting it was recorded in should be an inspiration to all of you that you can do it yourself. So you mentioned live. Can we expect any live shows anytime soon? Um, we haven't played lately just because um, school year is starting, but I would like to play again. We recently played at the Buddha Barn in Madison, which was a private venue. We want to do more things like that where we have sort of uninhibited time frame that we can do the things that I thought about on the record and I can pull in musicians to help me bring that to life live and you need a space where there isn't a lot of background chatter or like espresso machines going or you know beer sloshing around so something like a barn or places like um, people's living rooms if anybody wants to offer it up house concert that's right we're booking house shows on this show <laughs> we're old school this is punk rock so summer's coming to a close does that mean we should be expecting another record from Ponybird? I'm actually writing again I tried to do one year the past two records were on a year loop this time I took a break because I started to feel a little bit redundant I tend to write waltzes a lot I don't know why um, it's just what happens and so when I sit down and start writing waltzes again I'm like nope we've just done two waltz records hold up I'm gonna try and write again so I'm actually forcing myself to slow down and write something that interests me. So we're talking about the music of Ponybird. Right now we're going to go into a song live right here in the studio. This track's called Beacon off of the album Full Cold Moon. Jen D, take it away.
Connecticut, thanks again for tuning in. And from all of us here at Chips Unnamed Local Band Show, we appreciate the support. Until next time, stay classy, Connecticut.